P code to filter multiple pivot tables based on single cell value. On this sheet, I have four pivot tables. In each of these pivot tables, I have common field named city. Here in first pivot table, second pivot table also, third, let me move right, and in fourth pivot table. And right now, I have different values selected in this field in each of these four pivot tables. Now I want to select single value as Delhi across all four pivot tables in city field. So if I do that, it will require a lot of time because I have more than one pivot tables. I will go one by one in each pivot table and selecting Delhi. But this will take time. So instead of doing that, I have one drop down here in cell D1. Out of multiple values, I will select Delhi and then I'll click on command button that we can see here. Once I click that command button, in all four pivot tables, we can see that city field is changed to Delhi. without taking time. So let me select even any other value out of this drop down. This time let me select Mumbai and click on this command button. We can see that city field is changed to Mumbai across all four pivot tables. So this VV uh, solution can save our time if we need to perform this task. So let's see how we can develop this. So first of all, we will see how we can create this drop down. So here in D1, I have deleted the existing drop down. We can see that sheet name where we have pivot tables is analysis and data is coming from different sheet named as source. On this source sheet, we have column named city. I will copy this column and paste it somewhere else because I need unique values out of this column. Then I will go to data tab. Here we have data validation option. So using data validation, we will create a list, but before that, we will remove duplicate so we will use remove duplicate option we have just one column as city let me click ok and we have now six unique values so we can say that city column in source data has six city names so I'll copy these city names here. Go to analysis tab or analysis sheet. I will paste in column G and in D1 column, sorry in D column in cell 1, I will go to data tab where I am already in and selecting data validation. Here, in first drop down, we need to select a list. Second, in source, we will give reference to these unique values. If we face any challenge, we can even directly specify here name of cities like Delhi, comma, Pune, and so on. But let me Give reference, this is better option. Press OK. And from drop down, we can select now any value. Once we have created this drop down, we can make the font color of this data. Let me go to Home tab, make it white so that it is not visible. So, this is how we can simply create this drop down. Now let's look at the VBA code. 
that I have used here. So I'll go to developer tab, click on design mode, double click on this command button. So this is the simple VBA code that I have used here. Let me delete this code and write it again. So first we need to declare one variable of a string type dim a as string and then dim pt as pivot table. Once we have declared these two variables, then this workbook dot worksheets we have pivot tables on sheet named analysis within brackets within inverted commas analysis dot activate so this line is to activate although we would be already there but this will not give us any error and then let me assign drop down value to string variable so for that a equal to worksheets analysis dot cells we have drop down in d1 so for that we can say row number is 1 column is d that means 4 dot value once we have assigned drop down value to variable we will use one for loop for each pt in active sheet dot pivot tables so active sheet we are using here and we have already activated this sheet then with pt dot pivot fields in bracket we need to specify so we are using just one field named as city across all four pivot tables and then closing with a statement and with and within with and and with dot clear all filters and dot current page that means the value that we will be selecting in city field equal to a so whatever we will select from drop down will be passed here in each pivot table in city field in variable a so now i will close the for loop next so this code we can use to filter all pivot tables on that analysis sheet so let's check this code let me go to excel sheet click on the design mode so that we are out of design mode and let's select any other value let me select pune click on this command button we are getting some error so we have not used right name of field which is pt pt dot pivot fields so let's try again we have selected pune click on the command button and we can see that in all four pivot tables value is changed to pune so this is how we have created this simple vba solution that can save our time and it is very helpful when we need to update many pivot tables or when we need to compare multiple pivot tables and one advantage for this solution is if we are getting multiple pivot tables 
and even data sources are on different sheets even this solution will work so you can practice this modify this code according to your requirement i mean like if you have different field name or sheet name and let me know how it works if you want vb code for this you can check on my website also i will provide link of website in description and you can subscribe to my channel for getting notifications for more vba tutorials let me show the code again thanks for watching